In this video, I'm going to reveal 10 ways that you can make passive income with no money. Now, the great thing with this is that you just need a little bit of time and a little bit of consistency, and you can start seeing success with absolutely no money invested. For the best tips and tricks to learn affiliate marketing and internet entrepreneurship, be sure to subscribe to the channel and ring the bell so that you're notified when I upload a brand new video. Also, click the first link in the description or go to alstongodbolt.com forward slash start for my number one recommended way to start a full-time income online. Hello, I'm Alston with alstongodbolt.com. I'm an affiliate marketer and internet entrepreneur who has helped thousands of people across multiple platforms make passive income, and today I want to help you. All right, so as I mentioned in the opener, we are going to go step-by-step step, 10 different ways that you can make passive income without any money invested. Now, the great thing is, is you put in consistent time, energy, and effort, and you can start seeing results with each of these methods. If you wanted to, you can combine a few of them together, and I'll point that out as we go, but you can start seeing results relatively quickly with these methods. All right, so way number one is simply with Pinterest. Now, if you know, Pinterest is a social media platform. It provides a good opportunity to make passive income. What you're going to do is you're simply going to pick a niche and you're going to upload pins. Now, what I want to show you is my pins. I just upload five per day. I have 1.7 million impressions, 18,000 saves. So what that means is people are saving my pins to their boards and I have 525 outbound clicks. Now, this is what's important. These clicks, these clicks can go to affiliate programs that you find, which we'll talk about in just a moment. They can go to a digital pack that you create and sell, maybe an ebook, which we'll talk about in just a moment, or they could go to a blog, website, or YouTube channel. The great thing is, is I have 525 people that I've gotten for free going to various places that's helping me make even more money. So Pinterest can be a very good opportunity and it's really easy to set up. You just go create a business account. It's 100% for free. And then you can use a website like Canva to create pins and then you just upload them to your boards. You can create Pinterest pins in as little as 15, 20 minutes per day. Now I do recommend that you start with video pins because video pins are most engaging and that's what that's what Pinterest is really pushing right now. Just to show you the power of Pinterest pins, I'm going to click on how to make money online. It's a recent search of mine. And what we see here is we see people that are creating video pins about um, making money online. And the one thing that really stands out is all of the video pins. What you see right now is a wall of text and then the video pins are the ones that are really popping out and those are the ones that people click on. That's what I mean when I say Pinterest is really pushing video pins, they stand out in the crowd. The static pins kind of just blend in, the video pins really just pop out. And to get started with Pinterest, just do a little bit of keyword research. You go up to the search bar here and type in something that you're interested in. You could be interested in make money online or pets or basket weaving. I'm gonna type in pets here, for example, and I'm just gonna hit enter. I could probably search dog, but pets is gonna work too. As you can see here, we have a wall of static pins and what will happen is if someone sees something interesting they're going to click on the pin and they're going to do what's called a close-up and then from here if someone wants to learn more about your blog website or the affiliate program that you're you're recommending they can click on here and it would it would take them off of the platform so pinterest is a good way to start and that's number one my second way is actually with facebook groups facebook groups can be a really good opportunity if you own your own group it's going to be more of a struggle if you are a part of someone else's group so i recommend that you jump over to facebook and create your own facebook group it's 100 percent free and you just need to dedicate probably maybe an hour per day and you can dedicate that hour to scheduling your facebook posts out and you may start making passive income and you can make passive income in a few of the ways that we'll talk about, including affiliate marketing, selling your own digital products that you create one time or physical products for that matter, um, sending people to your YouTube channel, blog posts, whatever it may be, but you can start getting leads and sales. What we're going to do is we're just going to take a look at one of these Facebook groups. This affiliate marketing Facebook group has 38,000 members. If I click on this, you're going to see that they have a pin at the top and that pin usually goes to an affiliate link. I'm actually surprised these people don't do it. They're missing out on an opportunity. What I would do is I would pin the product that I'm selling or promoting to the top here. And so whenever someone clicks on my Facebook group title to enter into the group, they see the pin first. They see the, the pin post or the announcement at the top. So if we scroll down here, people are simply promoting whatever it is that they have to offer. The problem with this group and, and groups like it is everyone here is really just promoting their own product and no one's engaging or buying. But instead, what I'd recommend that you do is you create content to help solve problems if you're owning your own group and you can create your own group in anything. If you're interested in, in dogs and pets and affiliate marketing and making money online, you could create a group showing different tips and tricks to make money online. Now, what I did when I first got started with my Facebook group and it worked out really well is I would find different tips online 
and then I would put them in an image. I could, I'd go create an image over on Canva and then post that image right into my Facebook group. So if I show you my group here, it's a free group. You can join if you want 100% for free. There's a link down in the bio. If I go to images, if I can find images real quick. All right. So right now I'm viewing the group as just a member and not necessarily the admin. If I scroll down here, I can take a look at some of the images that I uploaded. I'm going to click on see all and images are much more engaging than just static text content. But if you scroll down here at the very beginning, I had a bunch of pins where I was showing people different tips, tricks, and tactics to make money. And the great thing with Facebook groups is eventually Facebook is going to start recommending your group to Facebook users that have expressed similar interests. It's really like free advertising. Facebook's going to say, okay, this person is consistently uploading content to their group. Let me find people that are interested and they're going to recommend them. But as you can see, I actually got these, a lot of these, infographics from fiber for like 10 or 15 dollars but you could do this yourself 100 for free using canva and get started right away but if we keep scrolling here you're gonna see images are the way to go i would start with i would start with video pins or video text then go to images and then finally um text so if we scroll down here you can see i'm just simply uploading images because they're the most engaging they're going to get the most traffic see this is a good one right here uh tick tock tips start every video with a hook and away you go it's really easy really simple and you can make these in like five or ten minutes what i'd recommend that you do is schedule at least four posts per day in the very beginning as your group starts to grow you can kind of scale back on that and really ask questions to get group participation because if groups are if group members are engaging in your facebook group that's going to tell facebook that this is a really good group and it's going to promote it to more people and so it's going to provide an even better opportunity but facebook groups are another good way to go another good way to make money is simply with affiliate marketing now what you see here on your screen is a keyword research that I've done with a tool called Ahrefs. This is a paid tool, you don't need it, but I pulled this up so that you can see the opportunity that is affiliate marketing. And believe it or not, the opportunity with affiliate marketing isn't talking about affiliate marketing. It's in Christian affiliate programs. It's in the Walmart affiliate program, makeup, golf. There are so many different opportunities. In fact, if we look up here, there's over 10,000 keywords that have affiliate marketing. And so the reason, the way that you would wanna do this is you'd want to reverse engineer. For example, one of these is going to be the Hobby Lobby affiliate program. We know that Hobby Lobby has an affiliate program. You can go over to Hobby Lobby and see what types of products that they have, and you could potentially create content to get in front of people that are interested in those products. For example, if we go to HobbyLobby.com, all right, so we go to HobbyLobby.com and it's an arts and crafts website. As you can see, they have all sorts of stuff for arts and crafts. What we could do here is we could go under departments and these are all different niches where you could create content. One niche that really stands out to me is the child arts and crafts niche. Now, over the past year, families have been home 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and you need to find a way to entertain your kids or else they're gonna drive you crazy. And one way that you could do it is you could create arts and crafts or, or create different um, things to do to take them away from watching TV. So if we look at this, it says kids, crafts, and activities. You could create an entire blog or YouTube channel about this and make money. This is a very good opportunity and you don't have to just limit yourself to telling people how to make money online. In fact, my first four blogs had nothing to do with making money online, but they made me money online. So uh, affiliate marketing is a good opportunity and there's a number of ways to do it. As I mentioned, you can do it with Pinterest, Instagram, TikTok, LinkedIn, um, you name it forums, Quora, you name it, there's a way to make money with it. So affiliate marketing is always going to be a good opportunity because there's always a new problem that needs to be solved. Over the past year, we learned that there were tons of new problems, how to entertain your kids when they're at home and they can't go to summer camp, how to uh, cover your face properly so that you don't catch whatever is going on out there, how to wash your hands. All of these different niches can help you make money, but affiliate marketing is another good opportunity. After affiliate marketing, we have Etsy and more specifically making planner stickers and planners. What I've done is I've jumped over to Etsy.com. This is 100% free as well. And as you can see, there are tons of different planner stickers that you could make money. Now, some of them are going to be very um, gender specific, but this is an opportunity nonetheless what you can do is you can go and create digital planners where you create them on a website like canva and then you download them as a pdf you can make them editable if you want to then you upload them into etsy and people will buy them 24 hours a day seven days a week and you can get paid 
Uh, the great thing with this is you create an Etsy store 100% for free and you can make money while you're sleeping. And there are a number of ways to do it. I singled out planner stickers, but you can just type in, uh, we can type in download, type in download or digital download. As you can see here, these are all different things that you could create and make money really, really, really easy. And you could use a website like Canva to help you do it. There are tons of tutorials on the internet. Uh, one that I wanna show you real quick to this week or next week is Independence Day. What we can do is we can go to Independence Day and you can see there are gonna be tons of SVGs and downloadables. This person's selling them for a dollar. We could take a look at, at their shop or their store and see all of the different products that they're creating and not necessarily steal them, but we can draw inspiration and potentially make it better. So Etsy can be a good opportunity if you wanna generate some passive income. It's not gonna be a lot of money, at least initially, because you have to charge a kind of a, a low price and Etsy takes a cut because they, um, they are the, the middleman between the customer and you. After Etsy, we have blogging. Now blogging is simply writing on a topic, niche, or idea. As I showed you with Hobby Lobby, there are literally millions, if not billions of niches out there. What you're going to do, this is my, my blog, AustinGodbolt.com. You are simply going to do keyword research and there's two ways to do it. You can do it free, you can do it paid. Figure out exactly what your customers wanna know and you write content to help solve those problems. Really easy, really simple. And the great thing with blogging is you can make money in a number of ways. You can have ads on your site. If I scroll down here, this is an ad that I would get paid for when people see it. I can have affiliate links on my, on my site. I can sell my own digital and physical products. This is another ad. If I close that, you can actually uh, get sponsored posts. Uh, let's say a, a large company sees that you are creating great content. They could reach out to you directly and say, we want to sponsor your next 10 posts. We'll pay you $10,000 or whatever it may be. As you can see here on the right hand side, I'm selling my own digital products. I make money 24 hours a day in several different ways, simply with my blogging website. And as I mentioned, this isn't my first blog. This is probably like my sixth or seventh. I have a number of blogs out there and most of them have nothing to do with affiliate marketing. After blogging, we have YouTube. So YouTube is a very good opportunity opportunity to make money. And just like blogging, there's a number of ways to do it. Now, right now you're looking at my homepage. Everybody's homepage is different. That's one of the weird things with YouTube. But right now you're looking at about 20 different niches that you could create content on. For example, a smoker, outdoor grilling is a niche. Um, this Kevin Samuels guy is a niche. Conversion AI is a niche. Everything literally is a niche. As long as you take your time to do keyword research, you can find a niche. Recently, I got into watching documentaries and documentaries had had ads in the beginning, middle, and ends of their videos. And the way to start getting paid with YouTube is you need to have 4,000 watch hours and 1,000 subscribers. That will come if you upload consistently. Most people try and catch lightning in a bottle, when in reality, you wanna make sure that you are consistently uploading content because that's going to provide you the most opportunity for success. But if you look on here, you can see there are tons of different niches that you could potentially create content on and start making money. Other ways you can make money with affiliate marketing, selling your own digital and physical products. Um, you can have paid sponsorships. You can do shout outs if you want to. There's just a number of opportunities where you can make money. After after YouTube, we have you can write and sell eBooks. Now, Amazon has this section called Kindle Direct Publishing, where you create an ebook and then you sell it on Amazon and you can make money 24 hours a day. And what I did was I just typed in ebooks, very general, very basic, and you can see there are tons of fiction and nonfiction ebooks that you can write. And the great thing is, is people are looking for ebooks on everything. You could type in keto diet, there's gonna be ebooks out there. What you'd wanna do if you don't have a topic or an idea, do a little bit of research and figure out exactly what people wanna know, create that content, make it into an ebook, and then post it on uh, KDP or Amazon. And what will happen is eventually people will start buying the book as long as you're creating a book about something people care about and you can start making money. So creating an ebook can be a good opportunity. You wanna make sure that you put a, a cover on it that uh, captures the eye and captures the attention. You can do that over on Canva or hire someone over on Fiverr. Another way to make money is to create and sell online courses. Now the most popular online course creation website is Udemy. They have millions of courses and this can be a good opportunity to make money. It is insanely competitive. What you'd wanna do again is you wanna do a little bit of keyword research. 
and you don't need a camera. You can do a slide share. You can do a PowerPoint presentation where you're showing people new things. Uh, as you can see here, I have a few different courses, some free, some paid, but these are all good opportunities. And again, you can make money in a variety of ways. Included in this affiliate marketing course, I can have a link to different affiliate products that will help the customer, help the student make money or achieve the goal. For example, um, this affiliate marketing, I suggest them get uh, click funnels because it's going to help them grow their business. I suggest that they get get response because it's going to help them collect emails and send out emails automatically. So there are a number of ways to make money even within Udemy. The value of the course is suppressed just a little bit. There's other ways to make up for it. And you want to make sure that you're doing your research and creating content on what people care about and not necessarily what you want to tell them. But creating a course on Udemy can be a good opportunity. After creating courses is selling private label rights. Now, many people don't understand the power of creating private label rights products. A PLR product or private label rights is where you create a digital document, kind of like what we talked about over on Etsy, and you sell it. You are going to sell it to a website like the plrstore.com. As you can see, they're selling it for as low as $2.99, but you are going to attach privileges to it. Now, basically what that means is you are going to say, you're going to add restrictions. You're going to say they can sell it if they want to. They can only give it away. You attach restrictions. And the cool thing is, is you can sell this to millions of people. Basically what you'd want to do is you can create audio, graphics, whatever it may be. I'm just going to click on graphics here just to show you. You create it once you put it up in the PLR store and it's going to sell for you over and over again. If you look at some of these, people are using these in YouTube videos, they're using it in blog posts, they're using it for paid ads that they're running, but this can be a good opportunity and it's relatively easy. If you want to create these graphics, if we click on this, you could create this for free over on Canva and sell them and, and make money. An another opportunity is to create WordPress themes, create WordPress plugins, and even create graphics for YouTube videos. For example, if we go over to videohive.com. So if we go over to videohive.net, you can see people are creating different graphics and images and stuff for, for marketers to use. Uh, for example, if we type in YouTube, you're going to see there are tons of YouTube graphics out there that people are using and downloading. Um, for example, look at this. These are different B-roll images that people are going to put right into their YouTube videos and you can make money 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And you could do this basically with your smartphone or if you buy a cheap camera, you have a cheap camera lying around. These are all good opportunities. Another great way to make money in 2021 is simply with TikTok. If you look TikTok here, there are a lot of opportunities and TikTok is a little bit more competitive, but it's still relatively easy to go viral. This video right here I uploaded late last night has 4,000 views already. And I'm basically showing people how to create digital products over on Etsy. If I scroll down, I have another video that went viral, I think last week, where it's close to 100,000 views. And again, I show people how to go viral or how to make money on Etsy. These are up to 60 second videos, as you can see here. This one's 50,000 views. Let me just make sure I'm muted here. All right, so uh, this one has 50,000 views and I'm not even showing my face. The screen's dirty. People complained about that, but people watch this video, they clicked on the link and they bought whatever it was I was recommending. And I showed people how to make money with Etsy. There are a number of opportunities with TikTok. It doesn't have to be about making money online. It can be about training dogs. It can be about basket weaving. It can be about arts and crafts. One of the big YouTube channels is a channel where they create content about things they didn't know they needed from Amazon and they all are affiliate links over to Amazon. So there's a lot of ways to make money. Now that you know 10 different ways to make passive income with no money, click the first link in the description for my number one recommended way to start a full-time income online. When you click that first link, you'll be taken to a free training where you'll learn how to get started step by step. Click the first link in the description or go to alstongodbolt.com forward slash start. Watch these videos next to learn more tips and tricks to make money online. Also, check out my website, alstongodbolt.com, for even more tips, tricks, and tactics to make money online. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and share this video with five of your friends.